So I think today is all about volatility in the oil market. And I'm just going to tell you guys, I've said this before, just put your blinders on right now, ignore it for a while, because the price is just going to keep jumping around for a while while OPEC settles into the production cuts. Uh, yeah. People are questioning, are they going to follow through, aren't they? Um, there's been signs already they have cut, and then some people are saying, well, production is still high. This stuff doesn't happen overnight, so it's just going to keep on bouncing. Now, last time we looked at our stats for the market, um, and, and this is the same thing with today, we're going off of a roll in 30 days, which takes us back to December 16th. So tell me how much activity you believe happened between December 16th, the end of the year, and today. And the answer is not much. So no. on a roll in 30 days, the stats don't look great, but that is for no other reason than because of Christmas and the holidays. Mm -hmm. so, so take this with a grain of salt. We're going to present the factual data as it is, but don't get caught up about the sky is falling or anything, because it, it's absolutely not true. Um, I just stole Gary Maser's um, saying, but, um, but that is not the case at all. This is just the way the stats are playing it. So let's have a look at the numbers. Um, price of oil is down slightly to 52.50 versus 53.67 last week. And our Canadian dollar has actually bumped up a little bit. 76.19, we gotta go to the bank. <laughs> that's pretty good. Isn't that pretty good? No, not. No. Well, I mean, oh, considering it's awful, it's pretty good. <laughs> Um, maybe we'll take a look at it. Um, so it's uh, 76.19 cents U.S. up from uh, 75.55 U.S. I like it. A uh, number of listings right now, Metro Calgary, 4,085 versus 3,953. And in Red Deer, 460 versus 428. Obviously expecting those to continue to climb. Yeah. As the weather comes in, people start getting their houses listed up in the new year. Well, and one of the things that I, not this is, this is a big indicator, but um, in the past, God, five, six days even, we've seen a big number in feature sheets come in. Yes. Which is great, right? So slowly but surely, you can even tell by the way people are picking up their marketing that they're starting to prepare for some stuff. Yeah. If you guys want wicked feature sheets, um, use the CIR uh, print option yeah. and get it done. Yeah. Um, Look for feature sheets. All right. As for our months of inventory in the Calgary marketplace, uh, sitting in a buyer's market, 5.67, um, single family homes, just in a buyer's market, uh, buyer's market or a balanced market being two and a half to four months of inventory. Single family homes sitting at 4.11. Again, this is all seasonal stuff. And condos uh, not making any improvements, sitting at 8.82. And again, we're just looking back those 30 days. Surrounding area, month of inventory. Okotoks 11.54, Airdrie 8.1, Cochrane 9.69, Strathmore 21, Sundry 17.33, and Red Deer 10.22. And obviously in, in smaller markets like Strathmore and Sundry, well, you see some drastic jumps just because there's not that much there. So again, grain of salt, don't take that as... Exactly, yeah. exactly, yeah. Um, and benchmark price, 435400 If you were to look back at our meetings last year, you'd see the exact same trend yes. and the exact same pattern that happened, especially in the smaller marketplaces like Strathmore and um, things like that. So, so that's it. That's, that's the market update for you guys.